Something to be aware of that seems to be kicking up a little bit of fuss at the moment is Naga City. They've been pulling over foreign tourists um, for not having a international driving license. Now, I'm not sure who's doing this and the reason behind it because, firstly, if you check, I would say check the LTO and with your embassy how long your license is valid in the Philippines. But if it's US, UK, for example, it's normally 90 days. So you wouldn't need an international driving license. It wouldn't make any sense. You would just get a Philippine one before the 90 days ran out if you needed it. Um, but it seems these motorcycles are rented at Pilly MC Rental. And I'm not sure if there's something going on where there's some sort of begrudging going on. Who knows? But they're stopping people for hiring motorbikes that from that specific place. Um, and then saying, well, you haven't got an international license. But I'm not sure how the, it, it seems bizarre. Unless they're actually saying that because it's a rental and not owned vehicle, then your license doesn't count, but it still doesn't make any sense. Maybe somebody else can pass some light on this. But the police uh, senior uh, police officer, chief senior inspector, uh, Irenio Andalius, said they had been apprehending foreign tourists over the past several months as tourists... At the CWC and in the city used to rent motorcycles for 5,000 pesos for two weeks from Pili Motorcycles operators. So I wonder if the people renting the motorbikes aren't legally allowed to rent them and the driving license has nothing to do with it. Um, maybe somebody else can cast some light. It's in Naga City. But from a foreign point of view, be aware if you're hiring motorbikes, it does seem that they're targeting you for not having an international license that you don't need. Um, what I would do if I was you, keep your license with you, print off the LTO um, sheet that actually says, says you do not need an international license and you've got 90 days on your current license. And after that, you have to get a Philippine license. Because if you're a tourist... Um, you're only there for two weeks of that. Anyway, they shouldn't be bothering you, but obviously they are for whatever reason. Right, thanks for watching. Yeah.